Hey guys, what's going on? It's Steelbus Light here, and today, um, a Sage One has just come out, and I've had a lot of fun playing it. And you, you, you sort of, it's different from DayZ because you, you learn from crafting things, mostly not from like the Wikipedia sites or different videos, but just running up people and saying, Do you know how to make this? Or they say, Oh, did you know you can make this? That's what I've learned. But anyway, I thought I'd make a quick video showing most, uh, most of or all of the craftable weapons in H1Z1 right now. Enjoy. At this point in time, the only craftable weapons you can make are a machete, a hatchet, a makeshift bow, a wooden bow, which is better than the makeshift one, spears and arrows. Okay, so let's start with the ones that everyone probably already knows by this point, the makeshift bow. For the makeshift bow, you need one scrap of cloth and one wood stick. You can find the wood stick in, like, the, the small trees that don't really look like trees. My friend describes them as the bamboo trees, but they're just basically very small trees. The scraps of cloth, uh, the starter t-shirt you get, you can tear up into four scraps of cloth, which is enough for four bows, and plus the sticks, you can you, <laughs> you can basically get an infinite amount by just running through these really small trees. For wooden arrows, all you need is a stick, and to find sticks, as I just previously very professionally described, it just run through the very small trees and you'll get some sticks. But, if you're trying to get those green arrow trick shots, then you're probably going to need a bow with better accuracy i.e. the wooden bow. For that you need two wooden sticks, and one scrap of cloth, and one spool of twine. Because of your sheer genius, genius, you already know how to get the wood sticks and scrap of cloth, but for the spool of twine, I literally have no idea what that is. I have asked my friends, they have no idea, I've looked it up on the H1Z1 wiki page, that has no idea, and even Reddit, I have resorted to Reddit, and I have no idea what a spool of twine is, but I wish you the best of luck finding out. <laughs> I'm just joking, I'm just joking, go away Jason, go away. If you're looking to become Jason, then all you need is two wooden planks and two metal sheets. This is actually a really easy weapon to craft, because the wooden planks you can pretty much get anywhere. I think the easiest way to get them is just to punch the shit out of boxes that you find in the back of shops. And for the metal sheets, you just find them pretty much everywhere. You can find them in warehouses, you can find them in, uh, in, in, in normal houses. Next on the list, the makeshift hatchet. Not as good as the, uh, the normal hatchet, but you can use it to kill people as a way. You can use it as a weapon or you can use it to harvest meat from wildlife, your choice. You need a wood stick and scrap metal to make this. Obviously the wood stick, you already know how to get it, you fucking genius, but for scrap metal, all you need to do is get a crowbar and beat the crap out of a car. All you need to do, crowbar plus car equals scrap metal. Just go up to your car with a crowbar and beat the crap out of it. There are probably other ways to get it, but I find that's the easiest way to get scrap metal. If you're looking for a bit of an extra boom, then I've got the thing for you, a landmine. All you need for that is one gunpowder, one metal shard, and one metal sheet. Judging from what people have told me, I think that uh, there's like a, an arming time, if that makes any sense. And uh, when someone gets within range of the landmine, it goes kaboom. Just judging from what people have told me, I'm not an extra expert on one, I've never actually made one. However, if you found this video helpful, then I would actually really appreciate it if you could click the like button, because it took me a good while to make a lot of research as well, and, you know, it's just basically me just trying to share what's going on, because I know how difficult it is when it is, it's not exactly paid to win this game, but when everyone knows all the recipes to make weapons and fucking landmines, then it can seem paid to win, even though people aren't paying for it, but they're paying with knowledge. But anyway guys, see you later, and the t boss layers out of here. Have a good day. Yeah, some days I feel unfazed Like when I'm with my friends with a cup raise hey. Come Monday, I got a gun raise Suicide, I'll do a die until hump day Then I go right back at it like an automatic More drinks, more songs, more beats to rap I need a shrink, I'm gone More time keeps passing, no watch, no thoughts at all Just a hat, new era Wet my P's and those O's Need a Phillies with the orange and black to feel home From Citizen Bank back to Camden Yards It's a tale of two cities, and trust we go hard Trust we go hard, yes we go hard You said we go hard